According to Forbes magazine, identity theft and related fraud cost 11.2 million victims an estimated $54 billion in 2009. So how do you make sure you're not a statistic? Follow these simple identity fraud protection steps and you'll hit identity thieves where it hurts. At least once a year, check your credit report and rating from each of the three major credit reporting agencies for fraudulent activity. You can obtain all three reports for free once every 12 months at annualcreditreport.com. In addition, there are companies that offer credit monitoring services for a monthly fee. To help prevent identity fraud, keep all identification and financial documents in a safe and private place. Provide personal information only when you know how it will be used. You have reviewed and feel comfortable with the company's privacy policy. You initiated contact and know who you're dealing with. Carry only those personal identification and credit cards you really need. Never put mail or documents containing personal information, including pre-approved credit card offers, directly in the trash. Always shred first. Be aware of people behind you at the ATM or anywhere else you swipe your card. Examine the charges on your credit card statements every month. Update virus protection software periodically and after every new virus alert is announced. Do not download files or open links sent from people you don't know. Enter personal identity and financial information only when there's a lock icon on the browser's status bar. And look for the URL to read HTTPS versus HTTP. Remember, the S means secure. If you must store personal identity and financial information on your laptop, use a strong password, one that is a hard-to-guess combination of upper and lowercase letters and numbers. Don't use an automatic login feature, and always log off when you're finished. Before disposing of a computer, delete personal identity and financial information using a wipe utility program to overwrite the entire hard drive. Keep these simple tips in mind and you'll minimize the risk of identity fraud.